So the Lord in the form of the deity performs pastimes, Leela. Just like Nurpi, Sriman Madhvacharya, he installed the deity of Krishna, which we all can go and now see. Madhvacharya did not order anybody to carve the deity. He got the deity in a cargo ship. It's landed on the shore of Urupi. The history is, this deity was actually originally installed by Vajranabha, the great grandson of Krishna in Dwaraka, when Krishna was present 5000 years back. The uh, deity was packed up in a huge piece of clay, tilak clay, and it was uh, being carried in a ship being used as some weight for counterbalancing. When that ship came to the shore, Sriman Madhvacharya asked, I want that particular huge piece of clay, that person who was taking some cargo for some trade. So he thought, uh, that is of no use to me, actually. He wanted to give something useful to Madhvacharya. Madhvacharya said, I don't want anything of your cargo items. I want that piece of clay. So then, when the piece of clay was brought and given, then Madhvacharya ordered some people to break open and said, inside there is a deity. Even before it was broken open, Sriman Madhvacharya knew that there is a deity inside. So how did he know? Krishna revealed to him within his heart. Esham satata yukta naam bhajataam priti purvakam dadami buddhi yogam tam yena maam Krishna reveals to his your devotees. So, Krishna revealed that I am inside this particular thing. So, deities are real person performing their activities called pastimes, vila. And we cannot uh, uh, understand or make out. Similarly, the pure devotees are engaged in assisting the Lord in His Leela.